Here's the garden today. Thanks for stopping by my channel today. In the garden, we're gonna be getting some anemones, cutting them and arranging them, and also planting my new David Austin roses that I got for Christmas. I'm gonna show you our compost corral because I finished that. It has four bays and the front has removable slats, so I'll show you how those work. Here are my two David Austin roses that I just received in the mail. They come bare root and you soak them in the water overnight which I've been doing. So they'll be ready for planting now. This one here is called Desdemona. This is called Strawberry Hill. I just uncovered the anemone bed from the Agrabon. I do protect it with this frost cloth so that the flowers have a little more protection. They really don't like to be frosted and too cold, but we've had some pretty cold nights the past few nights, but they seem to be holding on and doing okay. It looks like there's plenty of blooms for me to snip to get a bouquet to take inside, so I'll go ahead and show you that. Anemones are cut and come again flowers, so one bulb will produce 15, sometimes even 20 blooms. So it's really healthy for the plants to keep cutting the blooms off. And also you'll notice that I do cut some of them when the blooms are quite closed, but over time they'll open up and be super pretty. So it's okay to cut them a little tight. idea to keep your flowers in water while you're waiting to arrange them and let them hydrate themselves. Let's go check out the new compost corral which I just finished about three days ago. Now the front of these bins have removable slats so it's easier to access the compost and fill it up if you'd want to. And let me just show you real quick how that works.
Here's a look at the daffodils coming up. These ranunculus are doing quite well. They were planted in the fall, which you can do if you have a mild winter. And I also have these beds covered with a layer of frost cloth to give them extra protection and to keep any ice or snow off of them. Okay, back inside now. Here are some anemones I cut a week ago. And you can see they're doing really well. They have really good vase life and they've opened up a lot. Now I didn't really arrange these, I just kind of threw them in there. But they're so beautiful. That's all for today's video. Thanks for hanging out and I'll see you next time. Bye.